We're back. I can't hurt these guys because I have a wooden stick. Colin, you are a wooden stick. <laughs> Basically. Thanks, camera. This game is <laughs> shitty sometimes because it, it'll take control of the camera, but you don't really get any sense that it's about to. Huh? What? Oh, gosh. The door has opened! Now we can go to the outside this reminds me of... Did you watch um, the most recent... It, the mid-season finale for Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D.? Yes. How suddenly that guy was all like, and there were nine cities, and they cried out, and it's like, wait a minute, something's wrong here. We can't let fear stop us. <laughs> it's like, nah, he's probably fine. He's probably fine. Never mind. He just read up on his history while I was here. Yeah, he's just... found some cave drawings or something. <laughs> yeah. Weird how there's a whole ancient civilization we didn't see before, but that's fine. I did like the reveal with his leg. Yes. Oh, that was gross. That was so cool. It was great. He was like, why do I see... Po oh, no. So what? That's like a worm thing? I guess, yeah. Actually, it is an established uh, character in the comics. What is it? Um, my spoilers for Asian stats. Probably fine by the time this gets up. Um, <laughs> Hive. Oh, Hive? Yeah, originally created I by Hydra with, like, science. Huh. Yep. I have the cab loot. There's a hive in DC. Ooh. Oh it's yeah. It's an organization. Yeah, I think people are theorizing that's why they're not calling it hive. They're calling it um, the Hebrew mm. word for death instead. Yeah, they're the bad organization in Arrow right now. Ooh. Red led by Damien Dark, whose name is a bit on the nose. <laughs> Hi, they call me Edgar Edgar Evil. Hi. <laughs> Uh, just, but uh, Trickster was back on Flash this week. Mark Hamill? Yeah. I was surprised he had enough time during all of his Star Wars stuff. <laughs> but I like how he offhandedly mentioned that he's probably going to be in um, episode uh, 8, and everyone flipped their shit. <laughs> everyone was like, oh my god, Mark Hamill confirmed! It was like, well, that makes sense. Even if he <laughs> dies, we have the blue shadows or whatever, so... Fuck it. Why does any? Why is anyone surprised? I, I don't know. Hey, Kyrie. I I bought my ticket to Star Wars, so I'm just not ignoring everything now. She's so sad. Why is she? Push her through. Oh, I like how everyone has the same like here. Oh, oh, he's got her. Nope. <laughs> and what just happened is not well explained at all, but vitally important to understanding the plot of this Yay. game. Do you remember what just happened? She invisible. <laughs> Fair enough. Fair enough. Well, we'll, 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 here, I'll save that information for later. So everyone who, if it, if in control S, <laughs> leaving. <laughs> All right. Hi, guy. Oh, him again? Yeah. yeah, the first one was just training, man. Now it's the real now he's deal. he's got big, goofy shoes. He always had big, goofy shoes. But now he still has big, goofy shoes. Yes. But not Goofy's shoes. No, no one can fill those shoes. Except Goofy. Yes. No, it's like, he's clearly gigantic, but he tries to wear the shoes, and it's like, I can't wear these. What the fuck? <laughs> They're like hyperspace <laughs> shoes or something. His entire, like, foot still, like, he can, it'll still swallow him up. Somehow. <laughs> Probably. That would actually Gross. be hilarious. No, I'm con I'm convinced that there's something weird going on with the shoes. Something yeah, untrustworthy. <laughs> Woo! Yeah. Yeah. Oh. No, I need to figure out. I, I never like remembered or really bothered to find out who the composer was for Kingdom Hearts, but it's Bob. <laughs> yes. Like Bob Yamazaki or something like that. It's Danny Elfman. That seems unlikely. Does it ever go dun 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 <laughs> Got him. <laughs> I like how he's like, it's just sparking, but he's like, oh my head. <laughs> Woo! I always thought this was a cool enemy design, though. He's got that weird, like, hair thing. Goodbye! No! Hang on to the wood, it's cool. He let go, like, one finger at a time. You idiot, you were supposed to hang on. No, he's got very distinct levels of stamina in each finger. Now you're finger. gonna be lost in space. An intellectual property not included in this game. 
No, this is Lost in Time and Space, so he'll show up in Arkham in a little bit. Did you ever see the Lost in Time, Lost in, I mean Lost in Space movie? Yes. I feel like I did. The end freaked me out when I was a kid. That that seems interesting. Do you do you remember the the oh fuck what's it? It was like Jumanji but in space. Zethra. Zethra. Yeah. What about it? That was weird. I've never seen it. <laughs> there was a lot of like weird danger. But 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 do you remember in the 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 bad guy in Lost in Space? Uh huh. Do you, do you remember what he was? No. Yeah, uh, it's like, I don't, I don't remember the plot. At one point, they go, they like go to help out the ship, and it's full of like these space fighters. And one guy gets scratched by him, and they're like, and they don't care. And then at one point, he goes to the future, and that guy is one of the only people still alive. And he looks all messed up, and he's wearing like a robe. And then he like opens the robe, and he's like turned into a giant spider thing. Sweet. With like a long, stretchy neck. <laughs> I bet it looks really stupid now. Oh, I'm sure. Wait, can I? Let me see, babe. Oh, <laughs> Jesus, Pluto. Space. Bad guy. Whoa. Oh, here's an action figure of it. Oh, good. Do you know where we are? You know, I like. I guess I'm. I'm certainly the, the not the first person to think of this, but it is weird that. Seeing Goofy and Pluto travel together when they're both, in theory, dogs. <laughs> in theory. I mean, clearly Goofy's some kind of eldritch knowledge, but whatever. <laughs> Yay, we're in Traverse Town. He just has more insight than Pluto. Oh, hey, that's right, Titus is here. Or maybe it's the other way around. <laughs> Who knows, maybe Goofy's the result of experimentation. Hey. <laughs> Look, it's a Moogle. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, yeah, he's... You look like Titus, but I don't think you are. Yeah, no. Who are you? I don't remember you. It's Bob. You know, Bob. That's that's a Bob. Okay. <laughs> I'm all. I'm not gonna be rude. Do I have any mail yet? No. You know, it's been making me laugh lately. Huh. I keep seeing a commercial on Hulu for like some jewelry store. Uh, they have a watch or something, uh -huh. and it just like goes through the whole like dramatic thing that every jewelry store commercial does around Christmas of like the, you know whatever. Give her the gift of happiness this year. Yeah, that with your loving. And then love. it shows this watch, and the lady just says all the stuff really fast. It's just like solar powered watch, run, does, <laughs> powered by light, never runs out of battery. <laughs> just she says like four things about the watch that are all the same thing, really fast. That's great. <laughs> it makes me laugh. Hey, look, it's those ducks. Yes. Do you know which one's which? No. Do you remember their names? Wait, wait, I got it. That one's Michelangelo. <laughs> that means they left... Wait, Michelangelo is the only one who wouldn't be there because there's no orange. You failed. Shut up. You fucked it up. Yeah, he'd be Raphael. Okay, whatever. <laughs> there's no green one at all. Well, they're all green. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Did you see the dude in the trailer for the second... Movie? Uh, no. Yeah, it's got the. Uh, I think it's Bebop and Rocksteady. Oh, good. That's the 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 like Rhino and Warthog, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's got them. I forget because they're not in the new cartoon yet. <laughs> Thanks, Sora. But I did not see the first one. I don't. No. I don't think live action's a good medium for that franchise. What? What? How does that make any sense? Like, uh, I don't know what... I feel like you could do some cool stuff with some, like, gritty 2D animation if you wanted to stay true to, like, the original comic. I don't know. I don't... I don't know. <laughs> Well, I think this one's called the same thing as, like, the original live-action sequel. I think it's, like, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Out of the Shadows. Uh -huh. Which is an interesting move. Yeah. Considering that movie was terrible. 
<laughs> well, no, but clearly it means that we're gonna have either a reappearance of Vanilla I Actually, Vanilla Ice does like legit movie soundtracks now, so that would actually be really appropriate if they hired him again. <laughs> oh, and uh, Casey Jones is in, the, is in this one. Oh, cool. Played by Arrow. God damn it. Oh, really? By yes. Steve... Uh, Steve... Uh, no. Arnell or something? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you think that means that there's gonna be a fish, a salmon ladder in the, in the Ninja Turtles? <laughs> Probably. I don't. He looks out of place. He. I can't see him as anything but smarmy Oliver Queen now. And I don't think he's a gr he's great in that show or anything. He's all right. <laughs> he's been doing the like this whole season. I think he's been doing like the the Mark Wahlberg and the Happening thing, oh, where he's like, yeah. Where he's like slightly hired pitched and questioning about everything. <laughs> I love that. Is he supposed to be like a nicer guy this season? <laughs> it's not as heavy as that, but it's funny stuff. That's that's pretty great. Yeah, I'm getting money. Woo! Anyway, on the next episode, bobbles. Bobbles! Ow. <laughs>